New court documents show the Los Angeles Innocence Project is now representing Scott Peterson. Peterson was convicted in 2002 of murdering his wife Lacey and her unborn child. Her body was found in the bay months later. Peterson was given the death sentence, which was recently overturned and replaced with a sentence of life in prison without parole. This week, four motions were filed in San Mateo County Superior Court, including a motion for DNA testing, claiming new evidence now supports Mr. Peterson's long-standing claim of innocence. In the hundreds of pages submitted, there are new updated witness statements, and attorneys focus on three things. A burned-out van near the Peterson house around the time Lacey disappeared, the burglary at the house across the street, the Medinas, along with some evidence found on the shore of the bay. If this evidence pans out, as the Innocence Project says, this could be a game changer. Dean Johnson is a lawyer who has followed the trial since the beginning and says the heart of the new motion is a theory that Lacey Peterson was killed by burglars. And if you find the same DNA on the items from the Medina burglary, from the van and from the shore of San Francisco Bay, that's the storyline. The storyline is there was a burglary. Lacey was kidnapped by the burglars, put into a van, later killed and her body was later put, put at the shore of San Francisco Bay. Peterson's attorney, Pat Harris, wrote in a statement, I will confirm that we are thrilled to have the incredibly skilled attorneys of the LA Innocence Project and their expertise becoming involved in the efforts to prove Scott's innocence. Dean Johnson says there are still major hurdles for this new legal action. This is only potential evidence. The defense doesn't even have the evidence yet. They're requesting it and they haven't done any DNA testing on it, so we don't know if there's any DNA on this evidence. The LA Innocence Project declined our request for an interview, and we could not reach Lacey Peterson's family for comment.